after watching a video on a motivation for functioning depressives, the lady immediately started chilling her law of attraction manifestation crystals and books. So, yeah. <laughs> Jesus, fuck all Christ. Oh, yeah, that, that's, uh, that's annoying. Hey, you have a pr obscure problem? Buy my shit. Oh, okay. Yeah, thanks. Thank you so much. Welcome back to the stream, everybody. Or if it's your first time here, welcome. Hope you're all having a fantastic Wednesday, or whatever day it is for you right now. And so yeah, we're back to uh, the normal chill stream schedule. Uh, we're just going to do a chill stream on the Wednesday as normal. Obscure dot problem, yeah. Uh, I, I know that recently we've been playing Stardew on Wednesdays, but I figured, like, it's a chill stream, right? So, like, I just want to play World of Horror, so I've just decided that's what we're going to do. I don't think a proper therapist would say rubbing crystals on your asshole is the way to create healthy habits. Yeah, I don't think so either. Uh, I would like to think that psychiatrists do not do that. <laughs> but okay, yeah, so I want to play, I just want to play World of Horror, because, like, I want to beat it, I want to unlock all more shit, you know, so... We'll beat it more and unlock more stuff as a result. I'm thinking that if we want to unlock like a bunch of stuff though, we're going to have to maybe stop trying the priest and go back to like another hyper efficient character like uh, the swimmer. So we're probably going to do that right around here in a few little while. I think I'm doing well on my own though, so I don't need that video. But I like watching productivity motivation videos healthy mindset. My animal crystals are telling me World of War is a good choice. <laughs> oh god. Jesus. Jesus Christ almighty. Ugh. There is it. There it is. J.O. Crystal. <laughs> there used to be a time when I would just... Okay, hold on. I'll make this fucking stupid ass sound work. Unless you can hear it, you probably- or maybe you can't. I don't know, yeah, you can't. The desktop audio- okay, hold on. Okay, why is it- WHY?! Why does this keep happening?! Mother of Christ! Okay, hold on. Yeah. Hit exit on this. <sighs> okay, why is this not functioning properly? Why do I have two different headphones? What? Okay. Let's try that again. I will fucking get up, though, and I will grab a new fucking headphone cable. Nope, there it goes. Okay, it made a noise. You want to know what happened right there? Is that I went to my, my uh, sound setting speaker thing, and there's two instances of my headphone cables. So I had to switch to the other instance of my headphone cables. Oh yeah, we died last time. We don't have a new story. Okay, I'm gonna close my eyes, I'm gonna randomize this until we hit here. Okay, alright. Black and white tonight on this one. Do uh the custom playthrough that we like doing. I'm not fucking recording this shit. I don't know what the point of it is. Alright. We've seen this intro a billion times. Let's. Mm -hmm. Let's just be fucking crazy and just do, uh, the swimmer, you know? I like medical history, except that you can get injuries from medical history, um... From, like, a lot of n nonsense. I don't know about that. Play through with more funds, but can't have human allies. I could have a dog ally, though. Also, we, maybe tonight we can try uh, the timeline B at some point. Uh, how difficult is it? Cultist? Ugh. Just get in like one dub by doing initiate so I can feel better about myself. Normal. Okay, let's, go, let's go to one that involves combat. You can't run from combat. Let's do this one. Kathakatorasu! Once again, awakening from its slumber. Oiter. And we have no faith stat to manage. 
I hit randomize because I just I just don't want to fucking wait. Oh, what a nice what a nice shirt we're wearing. Go back first. Is this like her new default? Hmm. The, the hot jacket, obviously. <laughs> Medical history be like this surgery is a three hundred percent fatality rate. Yeah. Library notes. Uh, we'll use once. We have void. What the fuck? Oh, we can just use this to go get the fucking... We can use this to go get the fucking samurai sword. Should we cast this, like, before, like, immediately or some nonsense? That, that'd be funny. Also, let's go over here and, uh, get the funds. Go bathe. XP boost. Can I cast this literally right now? Oh, only when investigating. Okay. All right, all right, all right. We'll, we'll cast this then when we get to a zone with, like, a really bad outcome for us. I'll just be like, huh, fuck you. So, uh, yeah, we, uh... Alright, cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thaumaturgy teacher again. I remember this one. So. Investigate downtown twice. We can go, we, can, we have a cult shop and a vending machine. Not really a good place to acquire, like, a knife. Which, which sucks. <laughs> I would really like a knife. Uh, because of, because dexterity characters are just so fucking powerful. Uh, can you get a knife from a vending machine? A cult shop. Will the occult shop maybe have? Let's try it. Oh, ri oh, wait, no, this is a, this is an intel, I think, this is a knowledge weapon. Ugh. Fuck. Shite. Lost in time and space, you drift in nothingness until something pulls you towards the light. All right. Wow. <laughs> Wanting a knife and getting one that uses the wrong stat is so clap. Yeah, it's it's like you're you know you're a rogue. You're 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 a rogue in World of Warcraft, and then a fucking dagger drops, and it's a fucking intelligence dagger. Like fuck you. Can you just give them staves, you fucking mother you motherfuckers. Why do you have to give them this? Let's be it. Let's be maximum. Wait, no. I think I think this kills us. Let's climb the temple. Wow, you spent what feels like days climbing the stone blocks. Swing the top, you are war with the impossible vista of countless pyramids and beings too big to comprehend. Swing and you breaks. Yeah, I don't. I, that that literally just destroyed like five stamina, five five or six of my stamina or uh, my reason. <laughs> that 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 fucking blows. Uh, investigate downtown twice. Can't be healthy. Minus two stamina. Great. Wonderful. I love it. Uh, let's go hardware shop. Do they have a knife? Is there any chance they have a knife? They have a flashlight. Something. Let's go downtown. Again. Examine. Dexterity success. That's one of the things you do... Is that you have to? Is that you have to do some challenges that you know that you memorize from previous runs, so you know what stats go good with it. So like, I have eight dexterity, and I remember that that was a dexterity check uh, encounter, so I just went for it, and it worked. Find number three, go read the class. Weird sci schematics of some portals around the black work it up in the future. I guess. Okay. 
We have a flashlight. We still have no weapon. Go to the illegal den, I guess. Are you fucking serious? Hire an ally? Permit. You, you don't want to learn the truth. Oh, she reduces our doom by 13, by 10%. Yeah, sure. We just have, we have a hermit ally now. It's lowered our doom. Oh, wait, no. If we let her go, we lose reason, but acquire doom. Okay, I see. That makes sense. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's just, uh... <laughs> just following us! What a disturbing character. Ransack room of your recently deceased friend. You discover half-finished painting of a woman or scared... Your skin is ghastly pale yellow. The scene is disturbing. You struggle to look at it. Charisma check success. Unintimidated by the painting, it gives you new insight into the madness that possessed your friend. We're getting a lot of experience. John this painting? <laughs> Actually, literally, yes. Oh, you know what? I haven't done a prepare yet. Aiko's plush toy. Toy, personal, trinket, sl minus one damage, but it's minus two perception and minus one, minus two luck, which is very weird. Uh, I'll do it when my stamina, when my combat damage is really fucking with my stamina, I guess. Vending machine, occult. There's no way the vending machine will have a fucking knife. Try Legal Den one more time. Great. Okay. Throne items deal extra damage. That's hilarious. That's a, that's hilarious. We might have to do this, though, because we don't have a fucking main hand weapon, right? Campaign. Bandage. A bunch of damage. Uh, let's, let's do a stupid meme item. It's not going to help us at all. Suddenly it got really cold in the corridor. As you turned to leave, up by a man with naturally pale skin and giant lips. What the fuck? Gigolo? Gigolo. What on earth? We also can't run from combat. So uh, that sucks. Uh, can we throw this? No, we can't. Can we throw this? We can. Let's, uh, for lore purposes, not do that, however. Really? This is this is all we can do? 80%? Save sequence. Ow. Ow. Man, I love this. I keep hitting dodge and I keep taking damage. Thank you, game. Alright, we got him. Well, that fucking sucked. I have it nine reason now. Regain some. Escape village. This is the one where we have to kill the giant vagina building, I think, at the end. One bite won't hurt. Oh, no, I'm cursed. Okay. Feeling the eyes of the restaurant's guests on your back, you take a small bite of the smelly seafood. It tastes like the sea and melts your mouth. The restaurant owner nods and smiles strangely. It's bloated. Something is moving inside your stomach. It's a minor injury. Okay, is there a school nurse? Yes, there is. No longer bloated. Is it gigolot, a term for male prostitute assaulted by a sex worker? Oh, God. Oh? I used to reason plus item. I wonder what kind of animal the spider caught in its web. 
scare away the annoying predator and rip them to cocoon. Oh, it's a finger. I see. Nice ring! Gives us charisma and it's a C slot? Or we could just sell it for money. What the fuck is the use of money, though, when I can't buy a knife? So, I don't know, man. What happens if you sell it normally and you get one fund? <laughs> uh, sure, let's equip it. Who cares? Then I'll just, I don't know, I'll, I'll throw this. I don't know. Can I sell this thing? I don't really want another spell. I've lost so much reason. Unless it was a juggalo. I mean, I don't know if the Japanese would reference a juggalo in their game, though. You know, using, like, Western language. Uh, okay. I just got the nice ring for more charisma, I guess. Fish came home one morning, covered in scars and babbling about aliens. The police had them committed. They're mumbling something. Talk to them. Charisma success! And we have a new ally? You immediately understand that the only difference between you and the crazy person is you haven't been caught yet. You missed them to speak out and join your quest. We already had a hermit! We can't have two hermits? Oh, that's bullshit, dude. Oh! We should have gotten two hermits! We've been scammed! Uh, let's let's try again the elite. Well, maybe I go cult shop and find a better trinket of some kind. Holy candle! Plus one luck when it's in the inventory, and I know that it unlocks you able to do some actions that you otherwise couldn't do. So we don't we don't need to. Yeah, this isn't even an equipment. We just get a stat out of this. That's pretty good. This game is Polish. It's just inspired by J Oh! Wow, I feel stupid. <laughs> I had no idea. Catch a glimpse of an art class. One spring painting draws your attention. Gasp in horror. The twisted faces, impossible angles, and enormous monoliths make you sick. No, I feel sick. It's cool. Suko Jam was the most promising athlete in her school. Oh boy. Still no weapon. Still no weapon. The irony of throwing this. Let's go to dodge. Let's just go to dodge. Okay, let's uh save. Launch. Yeah, I didn't take damage. Aha! Your screams! Oh god, we have to fight the giant vagina now. Alright, well. I'm gonna throw, like, these at the... Well, at the thing. Well, maybe not this... C slot item, right? Replaces the nice ring. Yep, we know how this goes. Irony. Did that deal no damage? Oh no, it did one damage. Wow, that did three damage. That's hilarious. Okay, cool. I still have no weapon. Cool. Alright, vagina school. Alright. I get two doom every time this happens. I don't know if there's any point really in, uh... This has... This is just...
All right. Cool. Ending A, yep. I don't even remember what the, end, the second ending is. I'm aware that I gained a new level. That's harder to leave town. Take the key. Go level up. Fast swimmer. More, <laughs> more offensive actions. Discipline. Regain one stamina for all successful event skills. Hot bath. Improved resting at home. Uh, yeah, we uh, we definitely go fast swimmer and more dexterity. Because we're uh, balling. Okay, let's uh, take a bath. Go. I don't have a bottle, but extra reason. Like that. Uh, yeah, okay, let's just go next. All right. Yeah, rancid ramen. Split cloak. Oh, God! Yeah, a giant one. A giant one. We punched it to death. We remember this one. It's weird. Knife, please. Oh, it's a meat cleaver. I mean, it's a weapon. I don't like it very much, but it's a weapon, you know, so... What do I, uh, discard two item cards? Oh, God, I have to... I should have read that before I started doing anything, but whatever. Hang up. Minus one reason. Wonderful. Plus two funds. Minus one reason. I didn't really want that, but okay. Let's go to the vending machine now to get, get stuff that we can uh, ditch. Wow, they're all so expensive. Alright, energy drink. Hopefully we get we find another useless item that I can ditch. I can always get rid of the flashlight. But flashlight can help sometimes. We've been followed. That's all that happened, really. Uh, invite for coffee? Oh. I don't... <laughs> I was so embarrassed by my cringe behavior that I lost sanity. Does that, does, that, does that mean, like, most people on the internet have, like, two sanity? <laughs> oh, fuck. Literally me. <laughs> Takahashi, aha! Come jog with me. Less stamina, more reason. Okay. I'm out here taking psychic damage every time I remember something I did that was cringe. Run, it's a woman! But our character is a woman. Do I really have to discard these? I guess I do. That sucks, but... Yep, we found the smelly meat. Disgusting. Okay. Take a ride. Luck chance success minus 2% doom. Haha! -ha! Get fucked. Oh, fuck you, game. Oh, whatever. It's fine. Investigate lab. Bio plus meat. And leaves you with the papers buttering excuse of preparing to flee town on the next train. Wow. Ew. 
Ew, 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 Frank. Okay, yeah, well, we, we got stuff, so. Discipline outdoorsman, quick thinking, uh, more dexterity, more gain stamina. Plus one luck. The luck stat is unfortunately invisible. Always a way out from seemingly hopeless situations. I mean, that min maxes us more with dexterity, but we don't have a dexterity weapon. <laughs> Fuck it. Let's just get this and dexterity. Alright. Price hike! Fuck you! Well, we're broke anyway. Fine. Bathe, cold water. Let's go. Contagious coma. Uh, classic one. Done this a billion times. So investigate village twice. Let's go. Uh, yes. We knew it! The prophecies were true! The masked figure relaxes a bit, taking off their masks. We apologize for this, Master. Plus two allies, plus seven percent doom. That's so funny. Um... Why do I keep not acquiring allies? It looks around. Did you hear the? Never mind. Why do I keep getting screwed out of having companions? I was supposed to get more companions right there, but I, I got nothing. Refuse! Aha! Dust of seeing. Exactly what we want. Run! I have dexterity, so we run. Run. Pretty face, mind if I borrow it? God. Oh, those are some aspirations he got there. Five damage. It's 65 to hit, though. God damn. Try this. Uh, wow. No damage. Wow. Wait, what's that? You found lucky earrings. Literally just C slot or luck. I think that's objectively better than the nice ring. Okay, let's just use that now. There's no reason to hold on to it. Other than to throw it. Don't ruin the calm moment, plus one reason. Ah, I don't have arcane grasp. Oh shit, 69% doom. Nice. All right. Where you did the patient zero thing. Oh, see? This is why I wanted the holy candle. <sighs> this type of shit. Spend the night here, strength check success. Well, there was a good outcome anyway. There was a good, there was a good outcome right there anyway, so it's, it's fine. It just, I, like, I know that there's some items that if you have them, you get cool shit to happen. But it's like, no, I have to discard my fucking items. Search his flat with a light source. Oh, shit! Random... What? Random result after casting a spell? What? I can't sell it either. Wow, that's, um... A skull of wild magic, yep. Actually, literally.
So... Charisma check failure! How dare you, game? Can I throw this? I can't even throw it! Well, fuck. Dust of seeing, prepare yourself. Uh, minus two all is uh, pretty devastating. My to hit is still pathetic. But we can do this sequence and hopefully it'll... Okay, we dodge. We hit him once, we got hit back. We hit, we hit both times there. We got hit now. Come on. We deal a lot of damage. No, we deal so much damage. Come on. Uh, fuck. That was absurd. We're at eight and six. Awful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gaining levels is cool. Improved resting might... Honestly. Honestly, yeah, we're gonna improve resting. Library is disabled. Wow, this skull is even more useless. So what's that is off worse? It's still reason that's off. Okay, uh, alright. That was a big fuck-ass combat that did a lot of damage. Macabre Memoir of Mermaids. Uh, let's try Moonlight Sailors. I haven't done this one in a while. We're actually truly awful from the belly of the ocean. Dark writhing ooze that mesmerized him beyond control. He hid himself away for a week, adoring it, not to be seen until one moonlit night. A young girl spotted his boat drifting away. A single lantern swing at the helm. The captivated fisherman singing eerily to his catch. Now more and more fishermen have begun to find the vile loos in their nests, and one by one they are disappearing. Soon the ocean will have taken them all. Alright, well. Crazy. Discard two items! Fuck! Brr! What do you mean? You know what we're gonna do. We have improved resting. Woo! Okay. Now let's go buy some random shit. Ritual robe. Additional magic slot. Wow. Oh, you don't even... Kill me. But... Well, I'm, uh, I'm, not, I'm not happy about that. I am not happy about that one bit. Oh god, it's this sh this type of shit. Okay. Chance to hit is extremely high. Easy. That's the power of 12 dexterity. So, still don't have a lot. Get lost. Yay. Okay, it's time. It's time. I'll lower that doom. Even though I am now disturbed. Head like a whole looking ass. <laughs> yeah. He was a tapeworm or something. Uh, mask. Cool! You can discard this now. There we go. You find a huge pile of nets and hooks prepared for the big hunts. You quickly throw items into the ocean. Maybe that'll stop them from sailing out. Okay, yeah. Cool. Go watched. Retreat! Oh, fuck off, game. Okay, well... I can't be running around with so little, uh, sanity. Fuck. 
buy them around. Minus one money, plus five experience. I wasn't buying anything with the money anyway. Everything's too expensive. I still don't have a knife. Fills your mouth, it tastes metallic. Before you can react, you're low growling. Canis, the lunar cat. What the fuck am I looking at? No, oh, what? Dodge. Look. Attack, attack, attack. No, I can't. No, okay. There, wait. 90 and 90. Okay. We'll save this. Launch. The damage equals to one plus the number of your allies. Ooh. But I don't have any allies. Hailing from lush jungles of Tindalos, the lunar cats prey on struggling artists, sending them nightmares. I'm not an artist, though. Also, I shouldn't have saved that because that it had a, a look inside of it that we weren't going to use. This we can save, though. Oh, it just died instantly. Okay. I guess I should have paid attention. There's a cat's in Tindalos? Apparently. According to this. Yay, a minus two reason. Something gigantic and invisible leaves deep void in the sea. It's not moving, but you swear it's watching you. Oh boy. You slip out of night and race towards the beach, terrified of what comes next. Moon shines bright in the cloudless night sky. The ink black ocean's waves glimmer eerily. Hold on a moment. Just a moment. Okay, well, so... Oh. Yeah, we couldn't save them. Uh, I believe you need, like, a special item in order to get other endings right there, but... We got the extra quest. We got 15 more experience. Uh, well, I can use the school nurse anyway. Okay, time to do the last extremely annoying. We have 18 stamina and 7 sanity. This is completely fucking absurd. Alright, time for macabre mermaids. Morbid mermaids, I should say. Let's get seaside twice. All right. Brace yourself. Strength check failure. Oh, well, I'm using up that stamina that I have a, a surplus of, so. Pray at the temple because I want to get, regain sanity. Yes. You may be going crazy, but you said where something is watching you from the sea, minus one reason. Great. So I gained one reason. Cool. Follow the weird man. Perception success. Minus two doom. Good. That guy's like a guy who like plays D&D or some shit, I believe, is what the... Oh no! I've been bitten by a spider! Well, school nurse time. Fuck you. Oh, and also we level up. Cool. Folklore. Knowledge, luck, charisma. Let's do luck. I don't think we need 13 dexterity. So we're gonna plus five our reason instead. I think that's intelligent. I think that's an intelligent decision. You went to the kitchen, search for a weapon, steak knife, steak knife, steak knife, holy shit, 
Like, because, yes, this obviously deals more damage. But it has bad to hit. Whereas this is really good to hit. It's very fast. It's, and it, it goes with dexterity. It is a dexterity item. Big knife. For kids. Lose two stats. Yeah, sure, whatever. I'll, I'll keep the meat cleaver to throw. A growl makes you stop. It's a ghoul! Ah! Ah, dexterity overpowered build. How I missed you. Overpowered dexterity build. Ah, uh, at long last. Realize what's happening. Seven trick fit. I didn't do. I wasn't even using my money. I don't give a shit. Fuck you. Fuck! Fine. Escape the bathroom. Or not. Mermaid! Repair yourself. He has a lot of hit points, deals a lot of damage. Without tool, you know, I'm not gonna try that. Save. He hasn't damaged me even once. <laughs> I just fucking shanked this motherfucker. I shanked this motherfucker. Hey, I have a fire axe. That's cool. What? I swore it was Monday, not Tuesday, right? Plus 5% doom. Okay, what are our stats? We still have less sanity. Yep, all right. And here we are. You finally made it inside the cursed lighthouse! I was telling you two things, that whoever whatever's behind the weird events must be in the highest floor of this place, and that you should run away from this place as far as fast as you can. You're afraid there won't be any way back once you start climbing these stairs. Yeah, well, what else am I gonna fucking do? Plus 2% doom. One time. Start climbing. You did the Kirby meme. I don't know if you realized. I definitely didn't. I, I literally did not notice. Okay, find a metal gate that blocks your way. It's locked, but you notice the electrical cable. And here we are. I don't know why it's slipping from my, from my memory. Switch inside. Find the switch. Experience. Very cool. Select the second enemy you fought. Piccolo. Wrong answer. Fuck. Oh, I've lost. Oh! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The second mystery you investigated. Was it the vagina school? Or was it the coma? I think it was the coma, right? Oh, I lost. Fuck! <laughs> Shit! We were so close! Son of a bitch! You know what? I guess I'm gonna have to write down trivia answers for when we have to we encounter that nonsense. 
Okay, I'm closing my eyes. Gonna hit random and random and random and okay, we have a uh, we have piss yellow brown. Why am I so bad at this game? With a random backstory? Oh, here, here's, here's the, the blank backstory, okay. Uh, yeah, didn't you? But always do Ethotu. Like, this is like a bonus damage for some shit, right? Yeah, both enemy and my damage is increased. The problem with that is when we encounter, like, a doom, a doom damage enemy, and then they destroy our doom meter. So very, very frustrating. Okay. I don't do spells. Hardware monument. No, I don't care about the monument on this character. Uh, yeah, confirm and continue. Library notes. Girl will use it once. Book of Gore. Plus three reason and stamina to add a random injury. That's kind of funny. sell it. I don't want that anymore. Oh, wait. Wrong way. Wrong way. We want to go... No, not there. Here we go. He's like two hot jackets. Like this, like these two. Here's the fetish outfit for some reason. Nice movie poster. We'll get some experience in the bathtub. How, why? I don't know why that works, but that's what happens. Yeah, all right, let's go. We've done all of them before. Beckoning bulletin. Ah, yes, this one. Chop for items. You motherfucker, you don't even have a weapon. <laughs> Where's the knife? I have a bunch of money, so, you know, whatever. Um, I believe the map... I believe the map is, uh, really good for... random scenarios that... let you use it. Illegal Den. No! Hardware Shop. Pocket- oh, wait, the pocket knife is- it's not what I think it is. It's... Kill me. <laughs> I'll throw it. Oh, I can't even throw it. Oh, wow. Well, maybe we'll have to discard something. Biscuit color. I'm glad that that's what your interpretation of this color is. Attempt to climb it. Strength check failure. Wow, I'm so I'm so good at what I do. I write this for everyone wanting to stay behind. The sacrifice is worth it. Right, right. I still don't know how that helps us, but it exists. Not yellow enough to be like piss pissed me. Oh yeah, true. I guess it's like bread. It's like bread brown. I guess. Enter! I want the samurai sword! Enter the temple! Katana! Ooh, yeah! Ooh. 
inside a decaying nave. You find a keepsake from the ancient world. There's a humanoid skeleton wearing ruined armor. Its weapon looks strangely familiar. Katana, my beloved. Oh, man. We are gonna fucking kill everyone. Kill everyone now. Eat shit. Follow the weird man. Perception failure. Fine. Fuck you. Be it be that way. We want a B slot, not a compass. So flashlight camera. Flash combat action adds a chance to dodge the incoming attack. Plus, like, a knowledge character can use this to take less damage. That's cool. Our perception sucks. We'll uh, get the flashlight, I guess. <laughs> Cheap one. Experience. Excuse me. Wow, only 50% hit chance. I need to get better dexterity. It's nine damage though. I am totally doing this, it's nine damage. He didn't hit me once. Dead. Pick it up. Baseball bat. Cool, I'll throw this. It's also one fund. Antina ring. Uh? Uh, uh, that's mine. That's mine. I have nine dexterity. Oh. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. I think I can have the map in my inventory for this to work. I don't need to have it equipped. I got an item and it went immediately to my storage. Gruesome totem. Okay. Pocket knife is fucking worthless. Uh. Yeah, we'll do that. What the fuck is this? Oh, less reason, less doom. So, if, if push comes to shove, we could equip this. Let's store it away, though, for now. Oh man, I'm so happy we have the katana. I ain't eating that, fuck you. Fuck you. Damn it. But maybe since I had a flashlight, I'd have enough perception for that. Ooh. I don't want to eat human meat. All right. Go! Kairi Nasai? Welcome home. Like it so far? Yes. Remember the note. You recall the note you found. Could this be the voice of humanity you read about? Bracing yourself, you, you slowly put the phone to your ear. You don't hear words or a voice. You soon understand that they don't need those. It's difficult, but you manage to keep track of which thoughts are yours and which are theirs. 
Everyone is here now. We've escaped everything that held us back in life. We don't have any more burdens. You can escape with us. This is the purest form of existence. A paradise of connection. Everything deserves that. We will bring all of humanity together. Suffering is human. How can you... How can you believe that? Well, okay. If you want to suffer, go ahead. Consciousness dips. By the time you snap out of it, you're strangling yourself with a phone cord. The entity assaults your mind, but the struggle brings out strength you didn't know you had. You refuse to die. Minus 5 stamina, but plus 15% maximum. That doesn't go... That doesn't just go hard. That, like... That doesn't kinda go hard. That just goes hard. Listen to the sticky signal on the other end. It's harsh to your ear, but then the noise begins to change into something beautiful. Yeah, I'm sorry, Mr. Modem. I have a fucking katana. Actually, why am I uh, having a hard time with this? What's happening? So, all my actions are very, very, very high cost now. Huh. Okay. I'd be able to get that to 56%. Let's just go guarantee it. Also, let's throw this. Wow, four damage, okay. I think that's good. 9, 18, 27. Yeah, we, can, we, we killed him in three turns, okay? All right. Cool. Die. Wrench the phone from your ear, nearly tossing it across the room. You could have killed yourself for that thing. Sweat pouring down your face, you immediately yank the computer plug from the socket. Smash it to pieces! Less doom. Ton of experience points. Stamina reason. Boom. 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 Firepower. Oh, there's a bunch of rioters for me to kill? Oh, that's awesome. I get so much experience by doing that. Oh, look, more dexterity. Oh, look, even more dexterity. Wow, I have 11 dexterity with a samurai sword now. Hell yes. Our stamina has taken a hit, so we will use that version of the bat. Okay. Took a bath. In store do I care about holding on any I guess I'll hold on to this. I threw the bat. Oh, that was the first one. Oh, that sucks. Okay, well. Hey, Kana's with us! Evolving eels! Your friend living in the same apartment complex, Kana. That weird dude is back, you know, the one who studies fish? You shrug, opening the door. Kana follows and immediately enters the kitchen. A while later she returns to two cans of soda. Aren't you curious what weird fish he did bring this time? Did he bring this time? What's kind of do is a uh, minus one damage from attacks during combat. Okay, yeah, let's uh, let's go. Yeah, I'm ready to kill. Ready to kill. I think it's funny that if you actually go here and you talk... I, th I think that they have, like, a dialogue of, I'm right here, dude. <laughs> Plus two funds minus one reason. I don't really care much about money because I have a fucking katana. So I'm not really sure what I what I what what use money is anymore. Uh, oh, investigate seaside twice. Let's go. No! Stop! Take it home! Oh, 
called this event. Minus one reason. Now I have a, I have a statue at home. Might be this thing right here. I think it's this little thing. A bad idea. Ah well, too late. So. Lights. A few jars off those weird eel-like fish. Oh god, how she could how could she sip her soda so calmly staring at this disgusting creature? Oh yeah, that's right, I have Book of Gore. <laughs> I really need to heal super badly. Uh yeah. They're preparing for something. Oh no, I lost money. Ah, I don't care. Is he even alive? Mr. Ooh, your neighbor is a horror manga artist. He's struggling to come up with a satisfying ending for his new story. I don't want to share my experience. I literally give him experience points for money if I do that. What's that picture? Catch a glimpse of something that... Of the painted thing, suddenly you feel very weak and excuse yourself. Something truly evil has you in its grasp. Connor was right, someone tried to burn some papers. It must have been hurrying, yep. Yeah. Burnt notes. Crazy, okay. I'm gonna put this away again. No, I keep I have two levels of this thing now. God damn it. Stop! You have violated the law. They're halted by a sweaty police officer. Behind them are two policemen who are packing something into black bags. Focus on the officers. You know something weird? Every officer has a tiny tattoo on their neck. Who are they and what are they really doing here? Thinking about how stupid it is of Kana to try and break into your neighbor's apartment, you go to sleep. Spend the whole day waiting for Kana. Where the hell is she? Find an old trophy case set in a seemingly abandoned corridor. The thing inside is covered in a thick layer of dust. One metal seems particularly valuable. I don't have a tiny key. Damn it. Check the plaques and trophies. Luck, success. A gained experience. Khan has been missing since yesterday. Let's go. Let's go. Enter your neighbor's kitchen. You are shocked to see your countless jars of needles filling around relentlessly. Where is Kana? Bathroom. The swollen body of your neighbor is rotting away inside a putrid murky water. Both his eyes are bisking and countless tiny blood trails leading from the morning in all directions. Bedroom. Uh, I found the neighbor, but when his eye burst, I slipped in the blood and lost consciousness. I'm afraid there's something... In my own eye now, too. Well, I want to save Kana, so, uh, yep. Uh, uh, fucking disgusting. Stop. Ah. Rush to the hospital with Kana, getting a lot of attention from horrified people. Your friend is taken immediately to the garbage theater. Collapse on a chair in a waiting area. Yeah, stuff that fucks with the eyes is really, 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 really distressing. Fall asleep. Wake up, dude. You've been sleeping for over three hours. You groggily open your eyes to see your friend wearing an eye patch. Not so pretty anymore, eh? I couldn't exactly tell the doctors the truth about what happened. I'm pretty sure I won't be able to wake in my left eye anytime soon, but thank you for saving my life. Continue. Oh my god. 
yeah, it's a very distressing... Oh no, time skip! Take the key. I, kinda still following us, right? Yeah! <laughs> oh, there's my statue. There's my stupid ass statue. Uh, we need a, a sanity, a sanity buff. And does this ever become relevant? I have no idea. Which is the music, though. Contagious coma. Man, we just keep getting the same ones. But we need to beat it, though, over and over again. We literally did this one last one. We we know how this works. Discard two items. Ugh. Can this even be discarded? No, it can't be. Gruesome totem is too necessary. Uh, let's stop for like a, a shitty item that we don't care about. Oh. Fuck. Discard! Discard! Alright. Man, I love using one with nothing on myself. So much fun. Yes. Okay. Wait a minute, I thought I did. Oh yeah, it's solved. It says solved. I'm stupid. Confront the stranger! You whirl around and see who's behind you. Luckily, that person is a kind old lady! Point to the tombstone you were looking for. Experience points. Lost some reason? Oh well. Search the room. Cool, we found an item. Yeah, drink that, and I have 12 dexterity during this uh, whole thing. Wooden statues. Your man's very realistic. So realistic, in fact, you could have sworn one of them blinked. Okay. Pillar vampire. That makes sense. I'm going to massacre you now with this, uh, with this fucking sword. kill everything. <laughs> Aren't knowledge is perception. This is knowledge. So both of these actually give you extra choices during certain events. So these are also actually hot bath buzz as well. We don't particularly need hot bath though. Let's try this. All right. Maybe we'll get moments where it's, there where it's like, hey, fork folklore helps here. Search the body. Dexterity success. Spot a woman on the beach and decide to get closer and ask what she is doing alone at this late hour. When the woman turns around, you stop. Her mouth is opening and shutting, gulping in air as if it were unnatural. In her large eyes, there's only rage. Toy woman. Oh, God. Doesn't this, like, solve itself? Doesn't she, like, just drown? Wow. 
wow, just just cut her down. Absolutely cut her down. For one black mana. I have no money. Try talking to them. Less reason, more experience. Good, that's fine. Investigate the beach. No access to new options. Got more experience, though, so... We have 45%, so that's pretty good. Blood Moon! How dare you, you stacks player! Filthy stacks player! Fucking Blood Mooning all my non basic lands? How dare you! Okay, uh, yeah. Let's just go. It's the Tin Contagious Coma. We know how this works, and it's fine, because I'm going to just cut everything down. No, doggy! Why? Why have you made it so that I must kill you, doggy? Really? Yeah, this is, uh... There we go. I leveled up from this. Fight your way out. Strength check success. The guests mean business. Breaking into a run, you smash into a mourner standing near the exit. Luckily, they don't chase you. There's our good old dust of seeing. Running shoes. Smaller <laughs> doom penalty for running from combat. Uh, definitely this. Uh, I guess. Let's get luck, maybe. Sure. An invisible stat, but I might as well. Are there any injuries? I don't think so. I think we're crushing this one because of the katana. Time Warper! Is he British? Uh, I missed? How did I miss? Reality shifts your action was cancelled. Oh. Weird. Time is money! Did World of Warcraft steal that from, uh, from Gregory Horror's show? <laughs> Time is money, friend. I don't want money. Don't ruin the moment. True, yeah, it's common saying. <laughs> Check out the freezer. Oh. Or of countless autopsies stands before you. Jane Doe. Uh-oh. Don't I have severed ties? Sever ties. Uh, how much damage? Only six damage? Oh god.
faint sobbing from an alley nearby. There, you approach your man on his knees. When you take a step closer, he perks up. Oh, God. Ugh. What the fuck? Fucking, uh, hands are glued to his face. Man dabbling in magic, you found a journal. Had Nick Curse Mental. Highest ten chance to succeed on any combat action that has a base chance to hit. So I just have less hit rating. Okay, that that blows, but I have twelve dexterity. No. Uh Accept. Oh, luck check success. Damn, it has to be an injury. It must be an injury, okay. Well Dust of seeing time to fight the weird creature again. So, oh god, 50%. What the fuck? Can I do this? Ooh. That that's pretty considerable. If I do this, that's still only 70% hit chance. I think I'm gonna do this. Like, it's kind of absurd, but... Alright. Dead. Murdered. Killed. Art knowledge hot bath outdoorsman. I mean that's more luck. Maybe we need hot bath because uh, it's been a while since we yeah, actually don't no, let's try let's try this and dexterity, since we need more hit rating now apparently. Oh yeah, I don't care about that at all. Alright. That's 1312. Heal up a bit, and now we go to the last one. And we know how the mermaid one goes. Investigate Seaside twice. Let's go. It's always nice having Kana in the party. The waves lazily wash upon the shore. Take a deep breath. The fresh sea air clears your head. Cool. Cool. I've been bitten. Got rid of it. We have a really good. We have a really good uh, doom score. Take a ride. Oh. Take me for a ride. Yay! Hey, keep destroying my stats. Use your art knowledge to interpret the weird painting! Oh, I knew it! You gasp in horror and quickly recognize the dystopian surrealist style. You ask for the painting so you can sell to an advent art collector. What? Okay, that's a thing we just did. <laughs> what? What? I don't know what to even buy with this money. I don't want more curses either. I finished that quest, so we're just gonna. Fish head! Do 
doomed to enter? I don't know about doing that, though. Uh, everything is cheaper, though, because of Dog Creek. Yeah, sure, why not? Let's take a look. Salt. Uh, salty. Oh, we like this. We like this. Use that now. 14 dexterity. Something truly evil has your scent now. When you enter a metro car, you notice an oddly shaped package in the seat opposite to you. Mark with your name. When you reach for it, the package you s stop suddenly, seeing a familiar face in a nearby advertisement. And I am so... I'm going to be so salty if, like, at the last moment this, this thing kills us. Oh, and there's our sprite. It's become weird now. All the police. Charisma check failure. Oh, God. I'm going to be so fucking angry. Ah, oh, what a bunch of bullshit, bro. Um, hold on. Let's go to stored items. It's time to actually, uh, equip this. And, uh, store the patina ring. Yikes. I need Ikumi as an ally, which I do not have. Because I have literally never gone to the damn schoolyard at all. Oh, wait, no, I think Ikumi is actually uh, one of the uh, player characters. Maybe, maybe the med student? I don't know. Prepare yourself. 70% hit chance is not bad, in my opinion. Why can't I? You motherfucker. Oh, I can do that. Okay, hold on. Save. Nice. <coughs> Nice! Fucking massacred him again! With the damn fucking katana! How are our stats? 1313. 13. Remember how I said I was gonna keep track of stuff? I immediately for fucking forgot to keep track of stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna. Why does it look like that? Oh, all my items look like this now. Ugh. Yeah, I'm gonna throw the, the fire axe. Alright, let's try again. Let's try the lighthouse again. A snusk. Correct. I have to do this. So, we have a lot of doom, though, available. Faster offensive actions. I don't think we do any combats. Just in case, though, we'll get double luck. Following the windy staircase, you find a metal gate that blocks your way. The cable that should be powering it is currently disconnected. The power box itself is covered in a weird, moist goo. Inhaling the fumes makes your eyes itch and water. But to power the gate, you'll need to disconnect the faulty plug. Disconnect it. Ow! I don't have enough... Uh, my strength score isn't very high. You're surprised at how much effort it takes to disconnect the faulty plug. As you force it, weird goo burns your fingers. Finally, you manage to separate the faulty plug and connect the power cables. The buzz, the gate opens. You are stopped by a metal gate. Tiny... Page nailed to the gate explains that the opening gate requires you to grab two metal rods. Using your own body as a natural conductor, you will power up the gate. Not enough knowledge. Ow. Minus three stamina. Oh, God. Something is waiting for you inside, inside of it. Light your way. Light source seems to repel the darkness. Oh, who'd, have th who'd have thought that that's how it worked? Select the second enemy you fought this run. Hit 
killer vampire. Wrong answer. Five doom. Fuck you. Dirty. Stop by a girl wearing a dirty black school uniform. I'm sorry, but I can't let you go any further, she says, reaching for her bag. Anyway, it's too late. You instinctively take a step back when you notice the knife in her hand. You have to think fast. Try to reason with her. Not enough charisma. Tried to talk her into allowing you to pass, but suddenly she raises the knife and slices her across her own throat, nearly decapitating herself. Drawing cats? That sounds lovely. Dark clouds swirled around the lighthouse. Did you arrive too late? I sure didn't. The unnatural fog slowly lifts. You are relieved in a collapse on the floor. Woo! The next day, everything feels like a bad dream. You managed to stop the ritual, waking the Eldritch God. But what's done is done. It will stir and slumber again and again until the stars are right once more. Congratulations, you are safe for now. Cool! Man, we haven't beaten one of these in a while. Did we really encounter ten new enemies? That's crazy. I feel like I've encountered a lot of those, but I guess I haven't. Alright. Okay, I'm gonna close my eyes. Ooh, we have a we have a green and a pink. That's cool. That's a very that's an interesting uh Oh, quick play option. Uh, let's just, no, let's just go here. Did we have this before? Is this new? We've never done this before. And we get Yuri. Who is who? Is it Yuri or is it Yuri? I wonder. Well, I think we just unlocked a new thing, so let's go take a look. Aha! What the fuck? Hunted Harris. Yuri Okusawa, 21 female. Something terrible is stalking Yuri. And with each passing day, its presence is getting nearer and nearer. That'd be Yuri, right? Starts with a family curse. What's this weird thing? <laughs> What the fuck? Okay, well, we're gonna try this. New character, perception character. Yuri is being stalked. How will lesbians romance now? <laughs> they won't. They'll go to prison. Because they're the stalkers. We're using a new character. I'm gonna do initiate again because I'm a bitch ass motherfucker and I wanna win. So, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what which of these is best for. I'm not sure which of these is best for a perception character. I could always do this and then just never cast spells. I think we'll do. Oh yeah, we'll do that. We'll do at the Ozoloth or whatever. Wow, she looks so fucking nervous. <laughs> On the run. Until the horror catches you. Leveling up costs 50 experience less. What the fuck? Grow teeth. Adds a new combat action, bite, until the end of the mystery. 
What the fuck? The horror is slowly getting closer. Zero percent. What the fuck? <laughs> what? Okay, let's get the occult shop for a perception character. I don't want to cast spells, so let's well get the school nurse in the schoolyard. Legal den and monument. I don't need a monument. Um, witch's tree is fine. All that stuff is fine. Time to open a teeth shop. Wow, is it me or is she like seven feet tall? What the fuck? What the fuck? Library notes? No! I don't want to cast spells. I'll use it once. Protective carvings. Receive minus one damage during combat encounters. Costs four stamina. Huh. Yeah, sure. Might as well. The ritual. I assume that rituals are like permanent buffs or something. Let's go in here. Let's get stamina regain. Check outside our apartment. Oh no, there's someone. Oh no, it's spooky. Let's get fucking money. And also, uh, what outfits does she have? Runaway jacket. Magic sweater. Norwegian. <laughs> oh. That's why she looks like she's seven feet tall. She's actually a Norwegian woman. <laughs> oh, I hope the microphone isn't too fucked over for me uh, doing that, but... Though she's actually a Norwegian woman. No wonder she's so tall. Hey, my mom's a Norwegian woman. Oh, looks like your mom is in this game, bro. How does that make you feel? How does this, how does this, uh, how does this outfit make you feel, hmm? Honestly, this, this shirt is adorable, so I'm gonna use this shirt. This is a very cute shirt. I have a bonsai tree! <laughs> oh. We got one of the new ones! Oh, we got two of the new ones! Oh yeah, I remember you I remember you telling me that. I remember now. Just, uh, scooching myself upwards. My mom used to do leg presses with 12 reps. With 800 pounds. Yeah, I remember you telling me. Your mo your mother used to be, like, a, a female, like, strength, like, a... Was she a professional lift? Or was she just really, really into the exercise? Let's not do the rom. Let's not do ramen because I want to have uh, items to discard to it. Oh, do we do one of the new ones? I wonder. Oh, the fear festival takes us way, away, away from where we are right now. But it might actually perception characters might do really good with the with the the fear festival. Hmm. Let's do it. Let's try Fear Festival. All right. Someone is waiting for you. Just bodybuilder. Right, right. My parents actually got both got told they need to rest for longer between exercises. <laughs> Drawing nugget, yes! Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Batman wearing dusty overalls approaches you. It's the inn owner who promised to pick you up. Following close fan of your eyes are drawn to his hands, which are deformed. They resemble claws more than hands. You know, we're not gonna hate on people with deformities. Free action.
check your room. Action unavailable. Relax a bit. Resolve. Uh, enjoy the festival. Look for friends, buy souvenirs. I have six money. Let's go look for stuff. Woo! Faster spiritual actions. Interesting. This is a food that gives us sanity back. Why? <laughs> What's with this weird fish that gives us sanity back? Um, a pumpkin ritual mask. That's funny. Armor, occult food. Uh, and then there's this. Honestly, yeah, I'll take the candle. I'll take the candle. Festival grounds are open for vi open for visitors. Maybe you should check it out. Getting late. Joy festival. Would you like to test your luck at this fine game? Two tickets. Special prize for you. Creepy vendor hands you a map of the village. One building is marked with a red circle. Cool. Who are they? I don't think I've ever gotten this map before in this. The horror is slowly getting closer. 10%. No. Let's do this. What? You're not ready to go there yet? Oh. Forest. Remember the teeth woman from Smile For Me? Oh, God. <laughs> uh. How are you? Yeah. Oh, God. I gained another spell. Mana drain. Oh, excuse me. It's mind drain. That's not quite as exciting. But it's fair. Mana Drain is not fair. Five damage, regain two reason. I lose a ma one maximum reason. That's fucking ludicrous. Do I just want to forget this? I don't think I give a shit. I'll hold on to it for now. I have grow teeth. <laughs> not ready to go there yet. Keep exploring the forest. So we're a perception character, right? Investigate the ground for clues. Perception check success. You're not ready to go there yet. But why? Let's explore the weird village. Kindly refuse. I don't have a high knowledge score. I have a high perception score. Talking about something awakening at the next dawn. You wonder what's up with that? You decided to block the entrance to your room with a nightstand. The festival is ending tomorrow and you can't be too careful. You're not ready to go there yet. What the fuck? When will I be ready? Are they hiding something? Ugh. Can I go? No. Festival. Look for friends. You stumble into your friend Reiko. <gasps> it's Reiko from uh, Your Turn to Die. He's not wearing any makeup right now. Can you spare me some? T can you spare some time with me? Yes. Why is it so quiet? Why couldn't I go to the fucking... Angie. 
Angie. Angie. Angie. Completing mystery grants more money, okay? I'm Angie. Wh where is everyone? Yeah, Reiko's great. Today's goal, find the missing people. Why can't I go to the... I was given the stupid map. Why couldn't I go there? Fuck. You aren't ready to go there yet. Well, when it... What? When would I be ready? Damn it. Also, this horror is 20 per six, 26 percent... Here. Or actions till sunrise. Rest at camp. No, let's just go. I don't even have the flashlight. Try to decipher them. Knowledge check failure. You discover a giant plush toy half buried in a ditch. Feeling uneasy, you take a step back, but it's already too late. What? Thirteen hit points. Order your ally to attack. <laughs> That's so bad. Oh, I don't have a. I don't have a thing. What if we run away? Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Let's let's do that. An abandoned factory. Struggle. Oh God! It's disgusting. But then the police come. All right. I don't understand why we couldn't use the fucking map to go to the place. Bullshit. Well, I leveled up. Escapee. Whoa. Plus two dexterity, plus two doom. One dexterity and luck. But I wanted to actually play a perception character. Also, my dexterity is four. I would just take it to seven right now. I want to try and actually do a perception character, so we're going to do luck and perception here. Riots! That's no good. Okay. Let's reason regain. Uh, yeah. That's that's basically it. On the run. And the carvings are still working. Grow teeth is still. Maybe I should have used this to have a have like a more reliable attack. During uh, the, the the encounters, maybe I should use that. I don't know. Well, let's go look at these. So, school scissors is always annoying. Perception character seeing the dead. Yeah. What I want is a fucking. I really don't want to discard the candle, but I do have money. ramen I want I want I want a mystery where I can go into town and and like buy items and or something you know what I really really want is a perception weapon of some kind I'm not sure where you get them I know you can get gun I know that guns are perception weapons Hmm. I want to discard something first, though.
It's all two funds. Ugh. Smelly meat. Ew. Ew, gross. Gross. Smelly meat. Ew. Charisma check success. Okay. Cool. Also, honestly, let's let's do this. Now I have an now I have another attack I can use during this place. Read the letters. No! This shit again! Christ almighty! Got money, less reason. Okay. Let's see if we can buy a gun. Damn. Fucking hell. Hire an ally. Asafumi, I detect something. Plus one damage against ghosts. Weird. <laughs> That's weird. A cult shop? Maybe this has... Mummified heart. Defeat vampire enemy. Okay. Chance of ignoring reason loss. Or this one just regenerates stuff automatically at the beginning of a combat encounter. This is good for when I have to run away. This is good for running away. Let's get the funny mask. Now, now you don't have to look at my distressed face anymore. I just realized, I think I realized... I, I should, um... guys can't necessarily see my reason there we go now you can now you can more or less see my stats better there we go i forgot about that okay we completed the discarding of stuff so whatever cast a spell without paying anything Can I stack rituals? I don't think so. I gave it a try. Our master is coming! And we all can bask in its glory! Glitched magician. Yeah, I don't like that. You can't run?! What do you mean I can't run? Oh yeah, I have the bite attack now. That's right. Ally attack. The problem with the ally attack is there's a chance they just die. So if I can only do three of these. This bitch is biting people to death. I just bit him to death. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That was a lot of doom damage, though. So, that's not good. Need second sight skill? Fuck! Research the occult... Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. Why are all the characters that aren't dexterity characters terrible? <laughs> Why are they all so bad? Something truly evil has your scent. Bile plus meat. Now I get to level up from this. Test of will. Wow, these are so strange. Let's do, uh, yeah, let's do not. Sure, let's do knowledge. Let's do, no let's do double knowledge. Might as well, right? 
Now we have eight and eight. Sinking city. Exploring the seaside has a chance of inflicting drenched. I guess I'll get wet then, as if I wasn't already. Okay, uh, reason regain. I like it. Now let's go. School scissors holds us up inside the fucking school. Um, I don't. I don't really want to do school scissors unless I find uh, a knowledge or a perception weapon. So let's. I think we're gonna try one of the two new ones. Let's do this one. I'm gonna actually read through the entirety of this one because we have never done it before. Worrying right up of a wordless ward. <clears throat> You've got a call from your classmate's mother. I'm 21 years old though. With a teary voice, she told you your friend has a nas had a nasty accident and is currently awaiting an important surgery. They asked her to call you and request you spend a few evenings with them. That's weird. You haven't exactly had the closest relationship lately, but you agree to visit your friend starting tonight. This better not be Kana. Oh, we are trapped. <laughs> it's a FNAF. It's a FNAF mission. It's a FNAF mission. <laughs> Five nights remaining. <laughs> Shop for items. I would love to. Last man is at the hospital waiting the surgery. Ooh. Oh, none of these are... I mean, this is better than no weapon, right? Even though my dexterity is terrible. And we just started a new thing. Oh, hold on. Let's uh, grow teeth. Two stamina. That's fine. We don't need a weapon. We have. We can bite people. So n n none of that shit. I feel like. I feel like this is not really worth. Five nights at your friend Fred's house. Betty Fazbor. Oh wow, the horror is 72% of the way here. Do I just die when the horror catches me, or does something else happen? I guess we'll find out. Oh, this is a B slot. Oh, I'm stupid. Oh, I'm st Well, you know, having it is still good. Just having it in the inventory. Enter the hospital. You wait patiently the reception area. Ask about your classmate. You wait patiently in the reception room. You don't like the nurse's weird smile. Patients waiting for a special surgery? Take the elevator in the corridor. Fuck yo! Ow. Patients here are getting restless. What's wrong with this place? Check out patient room. Oh, your friend is lying on the bed, still sleeping after the surgery. Their face is almost completely covered in bandages. You sit on what must be the most uncomfortable chair in the world. Thinking how pointless it is to wait here, having nothing else to do, you decide to go and buy something to drink from the vending machine. Okay. No... Crash cat on fire, like, creates doom. Doom, so I'm not gonna do that. Let her sleep. Oh, that created doom as well. Nah, that's fine. The next day passes without any incident, and before you know it, another evening has come. With an increasing reluctance, you head towards the hospital. We have two money again, so let's shop again. Can I have, like, a, a C slot item, please? Yes. Enter the hospital. Corridor. Lost some stamina. Check out the patient room. 
Your friend woke up earlier today. You've spent some time talking about school and recent events, but still can't shake the feeling something about them seems off. Finally, they go to sleep. You decide to take a walk to stretch your legs. <gasps> Alarmed by the sound of glass breaking, you discover a corpse of a policeman lying in a pool of blood. It looks like someone or something tore out his throat. Steal his gun! Fucking steel is gone! It's a perception weapon! Ooh. Oh. What's this? You shouldn't open it now. <laughs> what could be inside? Okay. The next day on your way home, you are stopped by your friend's mother. She hands you a package for her child. You promise to hand it over tonight. I can't even rest anymore. Oops. Enter the hospital. Move to the corridor. You are stopped by two nurses. Ready to apologize and explain to yourself, you notice their weird smiles. Dead stairs. Sharp knives. Oh god, I remember this. So, um, I, I'm gonna fucking blat, blat, blat these people. So let's, uh, let's get this lady. Because I can shoot her twice. Is there any chance I can dodge? And shoot? It seems that I can. That, if that's the case, I'll do this then. I'll shoot this lady first. Ringing ears. All action, all combat actions are slower until the end of the current mystery. Now I don't think I can both dodge. Oh no. Wait, I missed! I missed! Well, that's bullshit, but whatever. Blah! Fucking shot him! Now we... Uh... Oh, right, right, right. Why are you alive? I shot you! Why are you alive?! What is this?! Do I not have bullets? I do not understand. Bite, 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 bite. She's taking no damage. What's happening? Is the... What? 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 You all saw that happening, right? I was hitting her, and her health was just not going down. I don't understand. Why did that happen? Uh, okay? What the fuck? I'm confused. We'll start, we'll start another one. Uh, we won't finish it tonight, though, unless we die extremely quickly. And now we have a nice, uh, peach color. Maybe there's a trick to it? Yeah, but here's the thing. We have fought that, we've fought them before. You know what I mean? Like, we've, we've encountered that enemy before. So I don't know why that happened. That was so confusing. Let's uh, try this lady again. I'll do initiate again, because I am a bitch. I am bitch made. Do 
You were... All event skill checks automatically fail. <laughs> What's the advantage behind this? There's, like, no advantage. Uh, yeah. Do it. Yeah, sure. Yeah, let's, uh, try it again. Run it back. Protective carving. Cast it immediately. <laughs> Occult shop. I should save this. Though so it always goes to this. Alright, yeah, no. We didn't uh, end up not being able to get any uh, mysteries, library notes. Use once, eat though to flame. Costs reason and stamina. And 2% doom, but deals 8 damage. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Okay. Look out. Anything in here? Nope. Alright, let's go. Uh, I kind of want to do this immediately because, like, we, we didn't get to see the end of it. All right. Cool. Cool. We level up very quickly, so maybe the compass is very good. Let's try the compass. And it's a C-slot item. Shibe! Yeah. Very, very cute dog. Steak knife. I don't have good dexterity. This isn't that good for me. This is also a C-slot item, though, but still having it is good. Yeah, we'll take that as well. Enter hospital. Move to corridor. Brace yourself. Luck check failure. Patient room. There's the dude. There's the friend. Okay. So we're back at this. Um, do I just try running away? Because like I don't understand what's happening. So let, can, should we just try to fight fight here? I can't even full prep the. Am I gonna I'm gonna punch you? See that worked. Like I'm I'm hurting them. Why did it not work last time? I just flail my arms from side to side. Come on, do the Mario. Dealing damage, so like. Why? Going to go driving practice, wish me luck so I don't die. Good luck, Miki. Don't die. We would all be very, very sad. But yeah, so we, guys, we just did this fight and I just punched them to death. Why did it not work last time? That doesn't make any sense. Oh! I have a steak knife now, okay. Uh, yeah, we're gonna rest. Uh, yeah, all right, let's just go. 
Branded like cattle, more doom. Doom, 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 doom. Elevator. Walks hurriedly past you. Enter the moor. Oh, uh, yeah, let's go patient room. Something is off about them. Curious package. Cool. You shouldn't open it now. Leave it. I don't have money to shop, so let's enter the hospital. Go to the corridor. This can't be healthy. Check out the patient room. Hey, your mom asked me to bring you this package, you say, handing over the parcel. When asked what's inside, they just stare at you. All right. Your friend has asked you to meet them at the cer at a certain scheduled location. Get there and you find getting there you find the telescope with a note signed by your friend. The note tells you to look through the telescope. Curious, you check it out. At first you don't see anything. Then you notice it, the bloated body of Ath Yolasaf is getting closer. The next day passes without any incident, and before you know it, another evening has come. With increasing reluctance, you head into the hospital. Trash can! Now we leveled up. Knowledge and doom. Fuck it, seems like an interesting idea. We'll do that and get one dexterity. Test of will, huh? Uh, check out patient room. Your friend just keeps staring at you. Did I tell you, you're really beautiful, they ask, twisting their swollen lips in a smile. Wow, uh, thanks. Okay. <laughs> okay, thank you. Don't go yet! Jesus Christ, bro. Continue. Suddenly, an empty bottle smashes on the wall behind you. You cover yourself from the glass fragments and notice a masked assailant holding a baseball bat. Oh, right. We have riots. <laughs> uh, 80% and it's three damage. Takes two more action points. My god. Dodging is such a... It's so hard. It's hard. It's so hard. We'll save this. Wait, doesn't this doesn't this bitch literally deal no damage to me, or is that already calculated? I wonder. I have a feeling that she literally can deal no damage to me because of my spell. Even if I. But I'm gonna test this by just. Oh, died immediately. Never mind. You found a prescription. For an expensive pharmacy drug. Okay. One night remaining. Okay. Corridor A. Slurping sounds from a closet. Okay, let's test this. Do they actually deal damage to me? Yes, they do. Okay, that's good to know. God damn it, I hit launch. I did not mean to hit launch. Uh, okay. Stabbed. Stab, 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 stab. Patients here are getting restless. Take the elevator. Turn to the reception area. The morgue. I don't think the pharmacy is accessible from this place. Let's go to the patient room. Final phase of my surgery is tomorrow. I just can't wait to show you the results. Can't help but shudder at thinking about the final day. 
I feel like it takes more than five days for you to, you know, res you know, heal from something like that. I'm gonna decline. Guess I have no diseases. Finally, it's the last night you have to spend with them. Enter the hospital. Wait patiently in the reception area. Suddenly, all the lights in the hospital go out. With a bad feeling in your gut, you decide to check on your friend one last time and get the hell out of here. You are shocked to find an empty bed. The parcel you've delivered lies unwrapped on the nightstand. Ignoring the faint footsteps from the corridor, you take a peek. Inside, there's a torn price tag for a butcher's knife. The footsteps are getting louder. You like what I did with my face? I've always admired you, you know, even when you acted like you didn't know me at all. I think the result is perfect. Too perfect, in fact, for two people to share the same face. Your friend raises the butcher knife you involuntarily brought. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh god. Sweet holy hell. Let's dodge, and let's vision, and let's do this, sure. Human, weak against blunt, no special skill. Ignored by everyone, this kid decided to replace the person that they envied the most, you. But I'm like 21! Why would you give a shit? I don't want an improvised weapon. I have a I have a fucking knife. This is too much. You cl what does this do, I wonder? S plus run? It's a form of running away. Uh, let's try that. I just want to see what happens. Oh! Okay, well. Smiling nurse wakes you up. This is your final day here, kid. Can't wait to finally get out of here, right? Panicking, you get out of the hospital bed and rush to the mirror. You had a nasty accident a week ago, you did. The nurse continues, writing something on the discharge form. A minor concussion and a few nasty bruises, so we had to keep you here. Okay. At first glance, everything seems to be fine. Sure, your face is slightly swollen and blue, but that's to be expected. Did you really have an accident and simply don't remember it? Y yeah, that must be it. This weird friend must have been a nasty dream. But as the nurse's smile gets wider and wider, why won't your shoes fit anymore? Oh. Well, we got one of the endings for this. Uh, it's not telling us for which ending we got. Minus four doom, plus one day. Oh, we leveled up, so. Uh, dexterity here would really help, but also art, no, art knowledge unlocks certain things. Uh, we are a perception character. You know what, I can just do this plus get another dexterity, so let's do that. Character's a real jack of all trades, I guess, because of like these special abilities. Where you get doom but get get plus two. Well, that's uh, pretty good. That's cool. All right, so we actually did that fucking mystery. Uh, what's our stats looking like? Thirteen, sixteen. All right, let's bathe and stamina regain. And let's look out here. Oh, somebody's being a weirdo. Someone's being a fucking weirdo. Fear festival. I'm just, I'm so incensed that I did this festival thing. I got the map and then I couldn't go to the place. Like, I'm just so angry. Like, why couldn't I do that? Okay, let's check this out before we uh, wrap up for tonight. Freakish fable of a frightening flood. A group of researchers from a university in Tokyo are researching a curious rock formation. It was discovered a few weeks ago by tourists in a village next to Shiokawa. You've read about it in a newspaper. The sudden disappearance of the tourists was the subject of school gossip for a few days, but ultimately no one was found. 
The rock formation must have somehow connected to the events happening in your town. Feeling that the researchers can help you, you decide to pack yourself, pack yourself and visit the village yourself. It's one of these. Neglected bus stop. Okay. Also, I should uh, put that away. Hybara Village, the final stop. The bus stops as the driver opens the door. Reluctantly, you notice you're still far from the village itself. However, before you can ask any questions, the bus's doors close. As the old bus drives away, you see the village in the distance, hoping it won't rain too much. You stop to look at the clouds. Suddenly, you hear splashing sounds behind you. That's strange. You thought you were the only passenger on that bus. Oh. Sweaty assailant. <laughs> okay. Man, this guy's a gamer. He's so sweaty. 90% hit chance. Oh, I can attack twice here. Okay. Me, me robbing you in an alley? <laughs> what? Yeah, gamers. Gamer robbing. Well, I am attempting to stab him to death. Why am I drenched? All combat actions are slower until the end of the mystery. That's disgusting. Fuck you, game. Managed to defeat the mysterious assailant, but he flees into the woods before you can tear his mask off. Who was that? Drenched because he's sweaty. Oh, that's so gross. That's disgusting. Reach the inn. Rest at the inn. Investigate the curious rock formation. You can see the curious rock formation from the bridge leading to the village. The researchers are nowhere to be seen. Did the weather scare them off? Continue. Rest at the inn. You enter the inn, hoping you will find the research team there. Every room is empty except one. In the last one, you find a visibly stressed man, Matsura-san, the expedition leader. Thank God you came. We've been attacked by the villagers and got separated. I'm worried for my colleagues. The things we've learned here, the knowledge is too dangerous. We must escape this place as soon as possible. Matsura-san gulps and looks out of the window before continuing. Last time I saw my team was at the school. We used an empty classroom to keep our research notes and equipment. You should look there for clues. Remember, we must flee before the river level gets too high or else, or else what? We have to go to their classroom for research to hopefully find them plus research notes. All right, leave the building break into the school. <laughs> okay. Dark forces scheme against you. Masochistic. You managed to find the empty classroom Matsuda-san was talking about. The researchers aren't gone, but hopefully the notes you found will help you locate them. Regain one reason at the start of each enemy encounter, but I have less maximum reason. That actually could be a lot worse. So we there's a researcher in the forest, the village, and the school. Well, we're here at the school. Let's look for this motherfucker. Also, what's this do? The pillars are related to the cult of Tut, fertility goddess. Don't you just feel like Every single ancient god and goddess has, like, the subtype of fertility deity. I feel like it's so common, you might as well have it be every single deity ever, right? Perhaps here... People here refuse to help us with the work and forbid us from researching the village's archives. Okay. Take a detour. You've managed to find one of the researchers! Hiroki Shinoe, theologist. Is he an ally now? No. That sucks. 
That sucks. Gods be horny and shit. Yeah. Did you know in Egyptian mythology, Osiris, like, like, jacked off to, like, gay sex, and that created the universe? Did you know that? <laughs> That's, like, an Egyptian mythology thing. It's very weird. <laughs> Uh, okay, so we need to go to the village in the forest. Let's go to the village. I have high knowledge. Follow the awful tradition. Ow, I took damage. Village. Location's threat level increased. Can I please encounter the goddamn... Following a weird light. You enter an abandoned village building. The whole room is illuminated by countless paper lanterns in many colors. One lantern over begins to get closer. Ah, yes, it's this one. I remember. Sever ties to our world. Do I have dexterity to also dodge? I think I do, yes. Hey! Save this sequence. I think this was pointless. I don't think I can dodge this creature, so that was a... Uh... You managed to find one of the researchers! Sakina Okada, geologist. Cool. Explore the forest! Oh! This went good the last time I tried this. Reveal yourself! No! Damn, that's not him. You hear the scream of one of the men. We've, we've, we've seen this encounter before. They shot me. Hasty aid. Take stamina damage in combat. Replace hasty aid with a new random injury. Oh man, I love it so much. So great. Wonderful. All right, I leveled up. Let's uh, go look. Escapee, dexterity and doom. Let's do dexterity, doom, and stamina bonus. Now we have really high- now we even higher stats now. That is, a uh, pretty high water. I have high perception and knowledge. Investigate for clues. Perception success, I gained experience. We found! Ka Kaori Yuto, linguist. River's level's too high, and waves crash against the village's buildings. Run before the water devours you. How do I escape? Let's go to the inn. Matsuda-san, the expedition leader, holds his suitcase in one hand and a knife in the other. This is our only chance. Let's go. Escape the village. All the villagers disappeared. Where are they? Investigate the rock. As you get closer to the bridge leading out of the village, Matsuda-san suddenly stops. I know this tune. Before you can react, he begins to undress and run into the darkness. Shocked, you begin to hear a faint moaning coming from the rock formation. What you see here feels unreal. All the villagers are naked. They are dancing around the pillars as something slowly emerges from the river. Oh god, what? Tichi... Tisitura and Kaibara's villagers. The Fertility Goddess. What? Oh, I'm getting bonus combat damage. And minus one combat damage. Okay, we still want to dodge. Seventy percent hit. Let's try this. Stabbing the villagers to death. I got him. Oh, I, uh, I have a broken nose. Resting is less effective. Oh my god. Uh, my nose looks non-existent now. Okay, I'm dealing damage. I 
I am stabbing this god to death. I am a badass. God damn. Be the T Sithra. Okay. The Eldritch Monster disappears as suddenly as it appeared. All that's left of Kaibara Village is a group of deeply confused villagers. Among them, you quickly locate the embarrassed Matsuda-san. Luckily, the research team parked their jeep on a hill that wasn't affected by the flood. Knowing that time is of the essence, they drive you back to Shiokawa the promise, and promise that they will alert the government. <laughs> oh yeah, because that's so fucking helpful to just alert the government. <laughs> Yeah, alerting the government is so helpful. Thank you so much, guys. That's totally going to go a long ways. Rest action is even less effective. Oh, man. Elusive. Minus five doom. Oh, that's intriguing. Or I could get nine dexterity. I don't know. I do have a steak knife. Let's do this and dexterity. Yeah, dexterity is fucking powerful. Take the key. Uh, let's go bathe and get stamina up. Also, let's go change her up to the cute sweater. I still have a broken nose that I need to get rid of. I just kept the research notes? Okay, they're just gonna go away in there. Cool, well. Unfortunately, it's that time, everyone. Did I decide to spend some time with your family living in a nearby town in rest? Feeling tainted by the horror you've experienced or deep inside you know you will be forced to return one day. Okay, you shouldn't take all these weird items. They will all await you in storage. Student allies will return to the schoolyard. That's fine. Okay, we can return to this uh, thing uh, next week, I guess, because I'm really intri I'm really intrigued by trying by the by going back to this game for a little while, especially since we just unlocked a new character and some new zones and stuff. So, thank you all very much for joining me here tonight. I really appreciate you coming here to hang out with me. We will be back in two days, Friday, if you live in the United States. And we'll be going at it with a new long-form game that we'll be doing on Friday, Saturday. It's called Kindergarten. It's a, it's a puzzle game. A very peculiar one. Um, one that even though I've watched it several times, I'm not going to fucking remember shit about it, unfortunately, because that is just my curse. I'm not going to remember the sequencing of any of the puzzles. But should be fun, should be amusing, should be hilarious. And then uh, we'll keep, uh, we'll keep, I'll keep track of like when the third game in the series is going to come out. And then when we're finished with the first one, I'll then return to the second one at some point in preparation for the third one. But yeah, that's what we're going to start uh, on Friday and continuing on into Saturday. If you want to see more World of Horror, we're going to continue this next Wednesday. But other than that, you know, like that's the plan. If you happen to be new here and you enjoyed spending your time here with us, if you think I deserve a follow, I'd appreciate that quite a bit. We stream three times a week for approximately two hours, and this stream will be re-uploaded to YouTube tomorrow night, where we'll join every single stream I've ever done. So if there are any you want to catch up on, you can find all of them there. Link is in the About section. And, uh, alright. Uh, <laughs> that, that's the dinner bell, so. Uh, thank you all very much for being here. I appreciate your support in every capacity. I hope you have a good afternoon, evening, morning, etc. I will see you all again soon with Kindergarten. Ciao!